It was here. Police say a teen was hit and killed by a train Friday evening. It's now where a small memorial grows yep. for the victim. In fact, I dreamed about it last night again. For Sharon Pittman, this isn't the first time. Pittman was there right in front of the tracks summer of 2005 when she watched 15-year-old Emily Roseth get struck and killed by a train. She started to come across before the crossing things went up and the second train hit her. I don't think she ever saw the other one coming. Back then, Pittman pleaded. Well, these young kids don't understand. You know, those crossings are there for a reason. Stop and wait until they go up. Even though the circumstances around the teen's death are still under investigation, Pittman says her message of caution still remains the same, even after 14 years. Parents, please tell your kids and teach them about railroad crossings so this doesn't happen again. For 14 years, she had let time heal her, but it was all undone as soon as she heard the news. Yes. Knowing this, Pittman says her heart aches for the other teen who witnessed the crash. Well, it's terribly horrifying. I had nightmares for months after that. And that's why, you know, the person that was with him, I can't imagine what they're going through. In Coon Rapids, Sharon Yu, Carol Evan News. Police have not released the identity of the teen killed in that crash.